In this tutorial, we're going to go over Leetcode 412 FizzBuzz. Now, this question is asking us, given an integer n, return a string array answer 1 index where answer i equals FizzBuzz if i is divisible by 3 and 5, answer Fizz if i is divisible by 3, and Buzz if i is divisible by 5. Now, we just want answer i to equal i as a string if none are true. Now, in our inputs here, we have 1, 2, and 3. 3 becomes Fizz as Fizz is divisible by 3. In 5, we get Fizz here as well, and then Buzz as that's divisible by 5. And for 15, we get the same thing here with Fizz Buzz as it's divisible by both 5 and 3. Now, for this question, we can answer using a list comprehension. Now, for a list comprehension here, we can just think a little bit. So we're going to have to set up all of these conditions and then simply just have it run on that. We can come down and we can do return and we're going to set up our list comprehension. Then I'm going to shift down a line and I'm going to do quote fizzbuzz. And I'm going to set that if i mod 3 equals equals 0 and i mod 5 equals equals 0. Now, what this is doing is it's setting this condition within our answer. And we can now come down and set the others. So we can do else quote fizz if i mod 3 equals equals 0, and that's only mod 3, not and mod 5. Now we can do the same for the next option as well. And we set that one up for i mod 5, as we have this condition here. And lastly, we're going to set the else statement for the string. Lastly, we can do for i in range 1, quote, n plus 1, and that's just to generate the proper amount of numbers within our range. So we just use n, the variable we're passing through, and that'll be all for our list comprehension. After that, we can scroll up and just double check to make sure there's no errors, and we can give it a test run. You can see our answer was accepted. We can then go and submit. Now you can see our answer here beats 60% in terms of runtime and 60% in terms of memory. Now that's you can do LeetCode 412 FizzBuzz. Feel free to leave any questions or comments down below or any other LeetCode problems you'd like to see me solve, and I hope that helps.